Hello everyone, Draymaster36 here, and welcome to another video. And in this video, I wanted to show off my custom Donald and Douglas that I made this past week. Now, Donald and Douglas were originally black, and uh, first off, they were knockoffs, so uh, I didn't really care about customizing them into their Railway Series Accurate Blue form. But that was pretty much my idea from the beginning since I got them, was to eventually turn them into their Railway Series Blue. First off, I masked off their faces and coal, and then cut them from their chassis. And then I got into painting. Now I first masked off their chassis so then I could keep them black, and then I painted the wheels and then the rest of the bodies in about two to three coats of a uh, light blue. Uh, and I think the more coats that I have, the darker it got, but I still feel the color that came out was pretty good. Then I painted their side, uh, or their side foot plates red, as well as added red boxes to their cabs and the red lines on the tenders. I then added numbers to their tenders so then it could you know differentiate between them i also painted what would be their smoke box black because then it's you know a different color it adds a bit more and then the foot plate right in front of donald and douglas's face i decided to paint white instead of leaving it the black just to again add a little bit of color there and when that was done the parts of the chassis that i needed to paint black because I cut one of the chassis with a saw first before I decided to hammer the rest off. That needed to be painted black as well as other, you know, bits here or there. And then I glued them on and that was it. Now I'm going to take a look at Donald here and explain why I decided to take the chassis off. Other than for the fact that taking the chassis off and masking them separately from the main body makes it easier to paint, because they were knockoffs, their magnets were also flipped the wrong way, so they would attach the engines wrong. Now with Toby here, normally he would attach, you know, head to head, uh, but now he attaches the proper way to Donald and Douglas, and the same thing goes for all rolling stock and all that. It was an issue that I had while filming, and I figured, all right, when I'm done filming with them for season one, I'm gonna take them, take their chassis off, customize them into their Railway Series Blue, and hopefully fix the magnet issue. And that's what I did. So any future customs that I'll do, there will also be knockoffs. And I'm going to do the exact same thing with them. Remove the chassis, paint them, glue the chassis back on. Because it makes it so much easier to film with. And it's also easier to customize. I hope in the future to make more customs. I'm planning on uh, making a Richard from Carson McKenna's series. Just to have in the background. Uh, I'd also like to make a Flying Scotsman using like a knockoff Gordon and like some other pieces. Uh, and maybe even a knockoff Rebecca. Uh, well, not a knockoff Rebecca, but make Rebecca using knockoff pieces and probably her wood version too. But again, we'll see what comes around uh, and what I decide to do for their, uh, custom models in the future. My next video will probably be going over a bunch of the props that I've made these past two months because I've made a lot. Uh, well, I say a lot, but it's really only a couple. So next video should be me going over that. With that, I'm Trainmaster36 Productions, and I'll see you next time.